And think about places you know Chester's visited. That'll help you. Traveling the world. Yep, Chester's been to India. Makes someone special. Yeah, that's right. In Kathy Zook's class okay. at Hodgkin's Elementary School in Westminster. It's really fun to have him in our class. It started about 10 years ago. Well, I first met Chester when my son was six years old. Oh, yeah? Chester is a guru. 149's right on the inside. Of geography. The fact that Chester has traveled the world, I think, is amazing. And then he, of course, comes with his stories. And, and he keeps a journal as well. He he is the fastest. He has been on a cruise. Stuffed land animal in the world. So this is his passport. Chester the Traveling Cheetah. This is the Philippines. Usually goes with Zook. He's been to the Vatican. He's been to Holland. He's been to Paris. But often travels with her friends. My vice principal wants to take him on her honeymoon this summer to Costa Rica. Celebrating faithfulness with a cheetah. Well, Chester's never been to Costa Rica, so why not bring him with us? And he's always dressed. I mean, he, he's, he never goes naked. <laughs> Chester faces tough security. Then they laid him out on the x-ray machine as he's going through, you know, and I'm like, <laughs> He's been treated like a VIP. He did get to meet Jim Lovell, uh, the commander of the Apollo 13. He's been severely soiled. So I have to take him to the dry cleaner, the spa. That's the spa. <laughs> he's been diabolically damaged. Yeah, I had one bad kid. She, he chopped off one of his whiskers. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I know who it is, too. <laughs> 57 degrees west, so. Chester. Yeah. Yeah. Hopscotch is across the globe. Luxembourg is this one. Because kids like Jesus Terrazas. Yeah, but Rome's over here. Can't. My kids, primarily in this area, uh, is fairly um, economically challenged. I've been to Wyoming. I've been to Las Vegas with my parents. For students who might not have the ability to travel the world at some point in their life, they get to live vicariously through Chester. Live. Oh, we were at six degrees, wait. And learn. These are coordinates of different places that Chester has gone. Number nine was Honolulu. But with Chester, we can actually relate to him and things that he might have done. It's fun to travel and you see so many cool things. For those who take Chester. So he's going with some friends to Korea here shortly. Just don't lose him. My friend um, Amanda, she's the music teacher here, and she took him on a cruise to Alaska. It depends on who you ask, because some people say that Chester got left behind at one of the shops in one of the Alaskan towns. They left him with her son's backpack in Seaward, Alaska. He kind of left the room in the middle of the night to go find some more adult entertainment, shall we say. A liar and a cheetah. Next day he was wearing sunglasses all day, carrying around a bottle of aspirin, I'm just saying. While some stories, and Chester, may not be real. You need to be over here. His adventures are. Now look up. Imagine hot oil is being poured on you and you're like, ah, as you're shot by an arrow. Yeah, I feel like I've gone more places mentally, but not physically. And there's nothing imaginary. It's a great job. About the passion to teach kids. It's a great job. Who usually don't go too far. Thank you. From Hodgkins Elementary. There you go. That's where your paw goes. With photojournalist Ann Herbst, Nelson Garcia, 9 News.